Two of the five Wheaton College football players charged in a hazing scandal have turned themselves into police. CBS 2 Susanna Song is live at the Wheaton Police Department for us this morning. Good morning, Susanna. Good morning, and those two players bonded out yesterday. Three players still need to turn themselves in, and the police chief is confident they will do so, and they will walk through these doors in the next couple of days. Overnight, Noah Spielman, son of former NFL player Chris Spielman, bonded out. Here he is in the front passenger seat of a black pickup truck leaving the police station. Hours earlier, his teammate Kyler Kriegel turned himself in. On Monday, a judge issued arrest warrants for James Cooksey, Kyle Kriegel, Benjamin Petway, Noah Spielman, and Samuel Tabos. The five Wheaton College football players face felony charges in connection with an alleged hazing assault of another teammate 18 months ago. The victim alleges he was beaten and left half naked in a park with serious shoulder injuries. Wheaton College conducted an investigation a year ago. Spielman's attorney says the players were disciplined with a one game suspension and 50 hours of community service. We walked away a year ago. Um, after talking to, the, to, uh, to Wheaton, thinking that um, the boys had served their punishment. If, if people believe there's a cover-up, they're, they're misinformed. There's always parts of a story that nobody knows about until we get into it. But there's a lot here. So what part can you say? Nothing. We'll try the case in court. Wheaton police say there was a second victim, but he did not want his incident to be investigated. The players will be arraigned on October 23rd. Wheaton College says, says the players will not be able to participate in any practices or games pending the investigation.